Okay, so today's word of the day is gonna be tacos. Taco, okay? Are you ready? In Spanish, it's taco. It's just like that. It's the same T-A-C-O, but you have to say it with the accent, okay? With a Mexican accent, okay? It's not taco. It's taco, taco, like, like a Mexican, okay? You guys, I wanna show you what I have here. It's an eight pound jackfruit. Isn't this so pretty? This is a tropical fruit. I'm not gonna open it yet because it's not completely ripe. It'll probably take a few more days. Hey everyone, I'm Yovana, and today we are going to eat jackfruit. A jackfruit is a tropical fruit and it's originally from East Asia. Seriously, it tastes like bubblegum. It's super sweet, the texture is like, even like bubblegumish. I don't know how to explain it, but it's really, really good. There's a trick to cutting it open. This one is like really, really ripe. You know that it's ripe because it's gonna smell. So just like a pineapple, you can smell it. It's gonna turn like greenish, yellowish. And today I'm gonna show you how to cut it how to take out the pods, how to eat it, and I will also show you a jackfruit ceviche recipe that you can use as a raw tacos, or cooked, or on a tostada, however you want it. So, let's get started. The first thing you're gonna do is that you're gonna take your jackfruit. You're gonna wanna use a knife that you don't care about so much because it's gonna get really, really sticky, okay? So you're gonna cut all around it, just like if you were cutting a watermelon. You're gonna start from the top and then go down, 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 around, and once you cut all of it and you get down to the middle, you're gonna just crack it open, okay? I advise you, this might get sticky, it will get sticky, but that's just how it is. So now that you have the two halves, you are gonna get some coconut oil, uh, rub it on your hands, and you're gonna take away all the pods from the jackfruit, okay? You're gonna do this with the uh, whole jackfruit or just half of the jackfruit, however you want. I would just do the two halves at the same time because that way it's easier, you don't have to worry about it and you just get all the pots out. So once you get all of that out, you wanna get another bowl where you can put the seeds in there, okay? All right, now we're gonna make our jackfruit ceviche tostadas. So we're gonna take the jackfruit and I'm gonna cut it into thin slices. This is gonna give it a real good texture with the rest of the ingredients and you wanna cut it thinly so that you can eat it easier. Once you have that done, you're gonna take about two cups of cut up jackfruit. You're gonna put it in a bowl with some cut up tomatoes, bell peppers, red onion, cilantro, lots of lime or lemon, whatever you want, some salt. I'm gonna put some coconut vinegar. And if you don't have coconut vinegar, that's fine. You can just add whatever vinegar that you want and mix that all really, really well. And you have yourself some jackfruit ceviche. Easy as that, it's really good. Good. The longer you let it sit, the more the flavors are gonna absorb and the better it's gonna taste. There's a few ways that you can eat this. One is as a raw taco, so you take a green collard leaf, you're gonna take the stem out, and you're basically just gonna put your jackfruit ceviche along with some avocado, wrap it all up, and do as many as you want. You can also do a tostada with a corn tortilla, so I basically just got a tortilla, put it in the fire for a bit, make it nice and crunchy, and then you can just just add your jackfruit ceviche with some avocado and you have yourself a tostada. Now for the tacos. You can heat this uh, jackfruit ceviche if you want and it's gonna taste, uh, I think, just different. I mean, they're both really, really good, but the flavors are just gonna be enhanced a little more in the onion and the tomatoes. You just heat it up really well and then you just take some corn flour tortillas, put some ceviche and put some guacamole on top and you have yourself jackfruit tacos. And these are the three versions of your jackfruit ceviche. Doesn't this look amazing? The moment has come to try the recipe. In my Spanish channel, I tried the raw version. I'm gonna try the cooked version right here. Jackfruit tacos. Cheers. Mmm. Wow, that you guys is really, really, really good. Even if it was cooked a little bit more, it could have been like maybe a little bit better, but it's just like that, it's really, really good. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have tried the jackfruit and you wanna let me know in the comments below, please let me know if you guys have tried jackfruit tacos or have another version of jackfruit tacos. I would love to know that as well. If you've never tried this fruit and you wanna try it, 
Also, let me know in the comments below. I love reading your comments, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you for all your support. Don't forget to subscribe here to my channel if you have not subscribed. And also to my website, ravana.com, to receive a free food combining chart. You can follow me every single day on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, Pinterest, all at Ravana. If you make this recipe, please take a picture, upload it on Instagram, and use the hashtag Ravana recipe so that in the next videos, your pictures will pop up here. And also, I want to like your pictures on Instagram. Love, like, blessings, and I'll see you in the next video, okay? Bye!